Hey there, my name is Tyler Olson, and what I want to do with this video is teach you how you can get your hands on some ORN. That is the native utility token to the new Orion protocol, which just went on public sale, you know, a couple days ago now at this point. And it was trending pretty hard in the last 24 hours because it did a 150% increase. Um, for those who don't know, the Orion protocol is a new platform in the DeFi space, and it's a liquidity aggregator, which means that it pulls together all the order books for extant, <clears throat> excuse me, centralized as well as decentralized exchanges so that you can attain the liquidity that you need for um, the tokens that you want to swap between. And what it does is it finds the most efficient and most cost-effective route to get you the token that you need. Yeah. So I had first heard about this project when I was initially looking into Holochain's project. Now, I won't go down the Holochain rabbit hole, but I just wanted to pay homage to the project because it was, um, I guess, the sort of the stepping stone to my acquaintance with the Orion protocol. And so once I learned about it and, you know, just heard the words liquidity aggregator and you know, I'm generally pretty bullish on decentralized exchanges. I think that they're the future and where we need to move, if not, in fact, where we are already moving. You know, this is a case in point. But um, once I came across the Orion Protocol and I heard of their project, I knew that when they were going to have a public sale that I wanted to get my hands on some of their token. So... A couple of days ago when it came down to it and I had my chance, I was asking around in the community and nobody could really um, tell me exactly how I could go about getting it on Uniswap because it is being traded on BitMEX, but I like using Uniswap. I didn't want to go through the whole process of setting up a BitMEX account and sending Tether or BTC or you know whatever. I just wanted to use... Um, Uniswap and do some, you know, ETH to ORN trades. And so I was asking around in the community, nobody could give me a straight answer until eventually somebody did. And because their directions in the uh, Telegram channel ended up being extremely helpful, I thought that I would make a video to help you out in case you are interested. So <clears throat> what you're going to need to make a swap for um, ORN on Uniswap is a MetaMask wallet. If you don't have one, you just go to metamask.io and you can download it. It's a, a Chrome browser wallet. Very helpful, especially if you're into utilizing the DeFi applications, which are growing at an exponential rate right now, um, if I'm not being hyperbolic. So you're going to want to set up your MetaMask wallet and then you go to uniswap.org and you can launch that app. And what you need to do first, and this is why it was confusing, because usually if you're familiar with the Uniswap app, um, you usually just pick what you want to swap out for the token that you're trying to get. And there's a drop down bar here, right? And ORN, Orion Protocol, was nowhere to be found. So. I was puzzled. But then somebody told me that all you have to do is go to this URL address, orionprotocol.io slash public hyphen sale hyphen two, and you retrieve this smart contract address right here on the um, front page. Now, if you have any doubts, you can go and check this in um, the official Orion Protocol Telegram channel. It's the same address it worked for me but you know don't trust verify uh, but I'm going to use this one for the demo because I already know that it works so you're going to have to retrieve this smart contract address from the Orion protocol website you're going to go back to Uniswap and you connect your MetaMask wallet right you're going to need some ETH in that wallet then what you're going to do to find the ORN token on this drop-down bar, well, to add it manually to this drop-down bar, you go and put that smart contract address in this search bar right here. 
and you see it will pop up. So <clears throat> if I wanted to remove it and show you, right, you just go add. Okay. Now it's here when you search for it, ORN. Boom. So I want to trade my ETH for ORN. And what I'm going to do first, we'll check the price 220. Okay. 0.1. So I'll get 11 ORN. Do the swap. I confirm it. I like to change my gas fee to uh, fast. Then you confirm it. And then there's one more step because although I have already added the ORN wallet in my uh, MetaMask, if this is your first time doing it, you won't have that. You'll have to add that um, token in your MetaMask wallet in the way that you do it is very similar to how you added it to the Uniswap interface. You're going to um, click assets, right? See, look, it's already done the swap, but it's not going to show up here because I don't have a wallet added. So I add token and then I'm going to put that smart contract address in right here. Sorry, we're going to go custom token and then you go token contract address and I'm going to put that contract address that I retrieved from here, right? Whoops. Just like that. Next. Add token, then you have your balance. Yeah. And so there was one thing that I didn't mention that other people said to make sure of um, is make sure that if you're using that smart contract address uh, to have your to have your um, to have your gas limit set to above 120k. But when I checked it the first time I did this, it was automatically set to like 160 something. So um, if you're sort of unsure, you can make sure to uh, double check that the gas limit is set to above 120K. So that's it. That's how you get your hands on some ORN, um, which I'm super bullish on right now. Um, a lot of my friends are super bullish on Orion protocol right now. And we wish it a continued success. If you found this helpful, party on. My Twitter handle is at Teozeo. Y'all take care.